All right, so we're sitting here with Patty. We just want to hear Patty's story. And uh, Patty, you've been coming into the office for a while. Tell us about what was going on before you came in the office. What was your life like? I was diagnosed with uh, two types of cancer in 1993. And I had bone cancer, fractured hip, other damage that had been done, radiation. And I had just gotten to the point where, through the years, I was lucky enough that I lived. But I was very, very disabled. My movement was very slow and painful. I was sitting a lot, very sedentary, and I'm not very old. I am right now just about 64 years old. So it didn't give me a lot to look forward to. In the last year, my first uh, plan of action was to lose weight and see if I could alleviate a lot of the pain and gain more movement without so much pain. But after eight months, my arms were going to sleep, my legs were going to sleep, constant pain. And then I started to see you, Dr. McLean, and... Yeah, I remember when you came in here, you, just, you could hardly move. I was, was barely bad, bad able to stand up straight. Well, actually, I could not stand up straight. And after treatments, which at times were painful, but it was almost immediate relief. And I do not have any sensation of my limbs going to sleep anymore. I have actual moments where I do not have any pain. Wow. And a, a lot of it, um, in doing this now, I'm able to stand, I'm able to walk, I'm putting in a an oriental garden right now where I've been laying mulch and moving rocks and those things may not seem like much to a lot of people but when you are looking at not being able to get out of the chair it's pretty important. Yeah and you said something you were real important the other day you said you just you were looking forward to a life of just being basically crippled. That's right that's true. And now obviously you, that's totally yeah. your perspective has totally changed. And yes because at one point I had been told that I was going to end up in a wheelchair more than likely because the damage was very severe and I understand that and I was left with the feeling that there really weren't a lot of options for me because my bones in the situation are, were fragile but the bone density had increased and so I kept thinking well if I'm strong enough, my bones are strong enough, maybe something else could be done. Yeah. So now you have hope. I mean, you've got a real bright future versus what you were looking at before. Yes. Would that be right? Absolutely. Awesome. Well, this is really our vision here at Maximize Living is at the Vital Energy Chiropractic and, and having people um, practice the five essentials of Maximize Living and having the life of their dreams. And now Patty really has that potential. So thank you so much, Patty. Thank you.